Best known for playing Eric Foreman in the popular sitcom That 70s Show, Topher Grace also made an impressive film debut with his role in 2001's Traffic, playing a cocky prep school boy who turns his girlfriend to heroin and cocaine. With his striking good looks and talent for comedy, Topher is often consistently compared to some of the greats in the business, and he's one young star who's happy to accept the compliment. Uh, soulmate in working with her. I've heard of other young actors who get comparisons with established actors and they don't like it. You know, they, they say like, well, I'm my own person. And, I, you know, when someone says, you know, Jack Lemmon or Tom Hanks or, you know, I think it's the ultimate compliment. So, no, I love it. Um, I just feel bad for Jack Lemmon and Tom Hanks, <laughs> you know, <laughs> being compared with me. <laughs> For his first big screen starring role, Topher played opposite Kate Bosworth in the 2004 love triangle comedy Win a Date with Tad Hamilton, but it was his role as the evil Venom in Spider-Man 3 that thrust him into the spotlight. Venom, we were always talking about Eddie Brock, we weren't talking about Venom being scary, I mean we actually barely ever talked about it. I think that's important that even with these bad guys that you see their humanity and you see, you understand where they're coming from. And even if you don't agree with it, um, I think it makes it scarier if you see that there's a part of you that, that, um, that kind of understands where they're, where they're coming from. He joined the cast of Kids in America, playing a college graduate who, along with his twin sister and best friend, is trying to figure out what direction he wants to go with his life. Topher will also be seen in The Crusaders as real-life civil rights lawyer, Jack Greenberg. <laughs> 